Hi, this is Jeannie with Showing Destin, and I am actually here in Fort Walton um, today, which is about um, 10 miles from Destin, and I am here with Deb Henley, and she is the um, homeowner here um, at this place that is right in between Eglin Air Force Base and Robert Air Force Base. And tell me a little about what you got, Deb. Hey there, we got a 2,000 square foot house. Um, it's got um, the... Um electrical for to be able to plug um, your um, generator in so you can run the house without um, having the electricity so you can keep the whole house running without the plugs. 2,000 square feet. We've got a nice little some plants and some things to kind of perk it up a little bit but let me take you inside and I can show you around. Okay. Hey we're inside. Um, this is our foyer so you've got lots of room to kind of set up. I've got a little half bath here with a pocket door to be able to for downstairs when you have visitors so they don't have to use your bathroom and got the, the um, utility room here for plug-ins for electric you got lots of storage up there and it leads straight out in the garage if you want to peek and see so got the garage out there got um, lots of remotes to get in there as you can hear the alarm it's set for fire and also for security so mm -hmm. it has two panels one in the master bed one here and all the windows and all the doors are alarmed up so you, you can keep safe and know if anything's opening up. This is the kitchen right here you have two different ways to go in we'll let you go in on the other side okay that way you have lots of people. We've got an eat-in kitchen here. The doors are the doors are where or the windows are where you can pull them open and mm -hmm. pop them open and make um, clean them easier. Got a nice, nice kitchen, lots of room here in space. You can mm -hmm. put an island here. Got a dishwasher. Um, got a saline um, countertops. Lots of built-in cabinets. Got the, the refrigerator here, and you've got a flat top cook stove here and a built-in microwave. You can see into the living room while you're cooking. So it's nice you can still interact while you're doing mm -hmm. it. Not all isolated in the kitchen. No, isolated. And you've got recessed lighting all around up here, except for over where the eating kitchen is. Okay. Come here in the living room. The tile is real nice. It's a darker color with the light. We just put in the floors in the last week. Mm. This is our living room. And also a formal dining room, or if you want to make a big family room, you can do that as well. But it's nice you can slide food over into here if you're doing it. Uh, lots of room. Got a, got a little uh, electric fireplace here, but don't really need a real fireplace in Florida because it's hot most of the time. You've got structured wiring throughout the house. You've got um, it's wired in the living room for 7.1 sound on um, both sides of the top of the, the room. So if you want to wire it one way or the other, you don't have to drop wires in. We've got the French doors here out to the patio, and you've got a little dog door or cat door if you want to use it. Mm -hmm. And the um, ceiling fans and lights are all have panels. Um, they're the roller panels, not the regular switches, and the. You can actually control the speed of the fans from the actual panels instead of having to go out and pull little strings. Very technical. Yes. Very nice. My husband thought of a lot of great things whenever he was doing it. <laughs> yes. This is a little closet underneath the um, stairwell. Cool. Got room to store all kinds of good stuff in there. Mm -hmm. Or have small children play. Yes, that too. <laughs> Come into our master bedroom. It's just off the living room on the first floor. Got a nice big room. You got tray ceilings up mm -hmm. above. Mm -hmm. I was rope lighting in them and um, you've got French doors going out into the patio which I'll take you out there in just a second and then you've got the master bedroom here you got a nice little pocket door you got a, a step-in shower here you got a whirlpool bath here on the other side and you got a double vanity and you've got a little bathroom over here with the door on it so you can someone whoever can have the privacy while mm -hmm. something else is still going on here and you got a nice big walk-in closet there for lots of clothes to go in as well. That's Very well thought out bathroom. Yes. And Very you'll notice well all the, the walls are bull nose corners, so it makes it just a little nicer and not having mm -hmm. those pointy corners. It just kind of softens a little bit. So I'll take you outside okay. to the patio. One thing we love about the house that we wanted was a smaller yard because we wanted to be doing more things than doing yard work every week. Mm -hmm. Give you enough room to be able to um, grow some plants and do some things if you want, but not where it, your yard owns you. So right. we did the patio, we added a little texture onto it instead right. of just the boring cement. So mm -hmm. it just adds a little bit into it. And also it's wired for a hot tub already if you wanted to put a hot tub nice. out here. You know, it's nice to, to have, but nice, good, established neighborhoods behind us. There's you know, um, people are real quiet. Mm -hmm. um, they've lived there for a long time, so it's a real nice neighborhood, real quiet, which I like. Mm -hmm. So I'll take you upstairs okay. here. All right, this is our loft area. You've got lots of wiring. You've got your structure wiring in here for an office if you want. There's the two bedrooms upstairs, like I said. You've got right next to each other. This one mm -hmm. here, with you've got your great closet. And then over here, this one's a little, a little larger here. And it's got a big storage area, but it's also got where the structure wire panel is for those of you who care about structure wiring. So, 
For those who know what that is, there it is. For those who don't, there it is still. It means left chords. Yes. So <laughs> for, those, for those people who um, don't know. You got left of, lots of outlets all throughout all the rooms. We When we built the house, we wanted to be able to set up things however we wanted. All the rooms mm -hmm. are set up for cable and for phone as well. So you've got a little, your bathroom for these two bedrooms upstairs are right here. It's got a little, a big closet for, for linens and then you got mm -hmm. the step-in shower on the side. Okay. And lastly, one of my favorite parts is all my storage area that I miss very much in this house. Mm -hmm. um, it is just, it's, we built it in, it's about, I think it's about 500 feet of, um, not part of the thing for the house, but it's just tons of storage for all your Christmas stuff, space. all kinds of things there. Yes. So come check out the house. Okay. It's just a wonderful place, great neighborhood, and come see what you think. Okay, thanks. I, I can see that you guys put a lot of thought into it when you build uh, the house. Love the house. Lots of great details. Thank you, Deb. Okay.